Hello friends, the topic of this video is data integration. So uh, we'll see what is data integration in data warehouse. So first of all, what is data warehouse? Data warehouse contains huge amount of data. The difference between data warehouse and DBMS is uh, DBMS or database contains small amount of data. Well, data warehouse contains terabytes of data. So that's why there is need of data warehouse. Now, uh, when <coughs> who use data warehouse, the organization having huge amount of data uses data warehouse and the data in data warehouse uh, came from multiple sources and combining that uh, multiple sources data at one place is nothing but data integration. So here is the example here. There are many data sources. This can be let us say DBMS <coughs> or any um, database. Then this can be, uh, let us say, flat file. Then this can be any CSV file. So uh, data is coming from multiple sources, which are in different convention, which are uh, which uses different different format. Now combining this all this data at one place is nothing but data integration. So uh, you can see there is wrapper. Now what is wrapper? Wrapper uh, takes the query from the data integration system and uh, then convert it into uh, the <coughs> format which require better data which require by the data integration system so uh, there are uh, one wrapper associated with one data source so it will convert the data into the required format now what is the advantage of data integration data integration uh, if you combine multiple sources data then it is very easy to analyze because all the data is converted into one unique format now uh, to uh, for data integration there is tool called etl etl means extract transform and load so uh, data integration uses etl tool so etl means extract the data from the data source transform into one unique format and load it into the data warehouse that is how etl tool works now uh, there are uh, various let us say issues because data has different different conventions uh, there is different uh, data coming from different sources so there is uh, <coughs> different different format so uh, there are some issues in the data warehouse so uh, we will see what are the issues uh, in the data integration so let us see what are the issues that can be in the data integration so let me clean the board. So the title is issues in data integration. So first issue is data heterogeneity. What is data heterogeneity? Heterogeneous data means data which is in different format. The since the data is coming from different different sources, there is data heterogeneity having different different semantics and syntax so combining all these data at one place is uh, one of the issue in data warehouse then next is uh, data scalability since we have to integrate huge amount of data the integrating that huge amount of data is very uh, complex task or it will be uh, it can be very tedious task so this is the second issue in the uh, data integration now third is you can say data security so uh, if the data is coming from different sources and if it is uh, secure then uh, we have to encrypt it or we have to decrypt it so that is again very uh, tedious task next is performance so uh, since the data is coming from different different sources and we have to combine it performance of, uh, of the system may affect uh, so that's why again this, this is again uh, one major issue uh, performance of the system may get it uh, degraded then uh, next issue is data semantics 
now different data has different different convention or different format so combining all these data uh, <coughs> into one uh, proper format is again one of the uh, big issue then uh, sixth issue is data compatibility see some of the data may use uh, html format some data can be in csv format some can be uh, some can use ascii code or uh, some can use ebc or dic code so since the data is in different different format uh, so data compatibility uh, or <laughs> combining all these data uh, and then convert it into one unique format is again uh, one of the issue in the data integration so <laughs> Uh, these are all the issues associated with the data integration. So that's it for this video. I do hope you understand what is data integration in the data warehouse. If you like the video, then please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.